Alright, what's good? Um, you, you live and direct with Grandbaby, 70 year rapper slash producer. You feel me? I'm on, on the motherfucking grind right now. I got some new tracks. I got some. Let me talk to y'all, motherfucker. Let me talk to the computer and shit. I got some new tracks coming out soon. You feel me? Let your nigga. I got my artist, um, C Money. Got a new track called Back Again, produced by me. So you already know, chill money in this bitch, you feel me? Shout out to all my niggas out there. And um, shout out to C Money Brother, Young Bandit, and that other nigga, uh, that other nigga, damn. Uh, my bad, fool. You know, you don't be fucking me a lot, so I really forgot some name in first. My nigga, Young Cutter. That nigga's over here before. Live and direct this deal. Hey, don't ask why it's a fucking chair behind me. That shit's a relic. I already know some motherfucking body don't notice the shit up in the camera. Down down the motherfucking comments and shit. But it don't even fucking matter. Grandbaby, you see me motherfucking, you see me, I do got, I do got ice and shit, but like, it's not on me right now. But you see me nigga, I got one motherfucking earring and shit. You see me, if y'all motherfuckers support me nigga, you know, I'll have two earrings. And I'll have like, eight chains, like I'm a great thing. No, I'm just playing. I was just playing. But for real though, y'all niggas need to support the fuck out of me, dog. Hit me up like Trill Tout, man. MySpace.com slash Grandbaby Music, you feel me? I'm on the motherfucking grind. I do what the fuck I can. I lost my motherfucking phone. I feel you, Drake. No homo, I feel you, Drake. And nigga, you lost your phone with all your days in it, too. So, I know where you coming from. You like my Michael Jordan story, no homo. It's like the Michael Jordan story. Let me break down the Michael Jordan story. You know how like kids always be like, I want to be this when I grow up, I want to be that when I grow up. And then like, most kids want to play basketball, right? In the seventh grade, I was kind of chubby. I was, I, I was a bad nigga. I was, I'm still chubby. I'm, I'm bad. I was a bad nigga. Man. I lost a lot of weight since I was seven. I'm getting on top of this shit. But seventh grade, I played basketball. And then I didn't make the team. I had a cold that shot, but I didn't make the team. No stamina or whatever, bullshit, blah, blah, blah. Try again next year. Man, they gave me that whole Michael Jordan story that Michael Jordan didn't make it as a freshman in college, in high school, or whatever. But you see what he became, you see what he became, and shit like that. And I'm like, motherfucker, don't tell you the Michael Jordan story, my nigga. That's like once in a million, like one in a million shot, you feel me? Like, don't tell me that shit. I'm not gonna make the team. They don't want me, nigga. I suck. What the fuck? No, they don't want me, nigga. But anyway, so like, the Michael Jordan story. And then, like, I've been hearing that fucking story all my life. The fucking Michael Jordan story. I guess that's for black people. For the white people, they got like the Lance Armstrong story. Some shit, I don't even fucking know. <laughs> the Lance Armstrong story. You know, he had cancer, but he never gave up type shit. You feel me? But anyway, Drake is like my Michael Jordan story. So that's why he one of my motivations or whatever. Except in this Michael Jordan story, I got more than just a shot. You know? Like, like... My other story, when I once played basketball, I didn't really feel like I had a shot because I was like, all I got is a shot. I can I can dribble, but not a lot. All I got is a shot. All I got is a shot. Okay, this story, this 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 situation, I got the legs. I got the beats. I can't sing for real, but y'all know I can make this shit sound good. Though. But anyway, so like, I got I got more than just one thing. So I feel like I actually got a shot at this. I think I can make this. So Drake is one of my motivations for this shit. But anyway, and then Soulja Boy, that's one of my motivations. No homo. I was explain that shit to y'all in a whole nother video. Cause if it wasn't for Soulja Boy, I would not be making beats. I would, I would not know how to expose myself. I probably wouldn't have this fucking camera in front of my face. But shit. Anyway, just fuck with me, man. I'm just saying. I'm just talking a lot of shit right now because. I don't know what I want to say because you know I'm, I'm new to this YouTube shit, so like it's one of my first videos and shit, just talking to y'all. So it's like I feel been a beast looking at some camera, and I'm talking, but this motherfucker ain't talking back to me, so I feel kind of crazy. And then like I only make videos when I'm like home alone and shit, cause like I feel stupid talking to this box and shit, and this box ain't talking back to me. Like 
like, what the fuck? And then people be outside listening, it's like, what the fuck this nigga talking about? Who is he talking to and shit? So, yeah. It's gonna take me some time to get used to it and shit, you feel me? But anyway, we gonna get to that. Just hit me up, 281-409-1833. You know, book a nigga, do anything. I'm in Texas, Houston, KD area, y'all ain't fucking mad at that. Just hit me up. But anyway, all of our grands, we're blessing this bitch. I got that one.